Next Monday, millions will turn their eyes to the sky. Eclipse fever is rising right now, but so is concern about how to safely view this historic event. Well, a new survey finds nearly 30% of Americans don't realize looking at the eclipse directly can cause permanent eye damage. And some people who think they have proper eye protection may actually be getting scammed. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge and consumer investigator Hank Winchester are live with exactly what you need to know to safely watch the eclipse. Yeah, Kimberly DeMond, this information is really important. And, and Dr. McGeorge, you know, I thought incorrectly yeah. that even maybe just a quick glance would be okay. But that's not the case. Even a short amount of time could cause significant damage, right? That's absolutely right. You know, we have all had that moment of feeling like we're being blinded by the bright sunshine. But we generally try to avoid staring at the sun unless, right. of course, it is a significant celestial event like this one. A total solar eclipse is certainly a sight to be seen, but doing it safely is key. It's really, really bad to look at the sun. You should not look at the sun. There are many ways to look at it, either directly, through a filter, or indirectly. Dr. Nitin Kumar, an ophthalmologist at Henry Ford Health, warns even a brief glance can damage your vision. People are curious. They want to take a look and they look directly at the sun, what they're doing is they are basically using a magnifying glass to focus the sun's light directly onto their retina, um, which causes thermal damage to those photoreceptors, which can oftentimes be permanent. Once those retinal cells are damaged or burned, they can't be replaced. How quickly your eyes would be injured depends on several factors, but it can happen fast. 30 seconds or more certainly would cause uh, some damage. While the sun can always cause eye damage, an eclipse holds extra risk simply because of the desire to see it. Solar retinopathy happens all the time. It's just that most people aren't interested in looking at the sun, uh, except for when these types of events happen. So plan ahead to get proper eye protection and spread the word about the risk. Just don't do it. It's not worth permanent damage to your vision. Now, unfortunately, we are also seeing eclipse-related scams, and that actually involves people selling eyewear that just isn't up to code in order to offer you the protection that you need. And Hank is working on that part of the story. Yeah, unfortunately, we're seeing these scammers already online. The Better Business Bureau has important information for you tonight. Take a look. The solar eclipse, an event capturing the attention of people around the world, and the scammers know it. Unfortunately, some are already creating and selling products that could actually create big health implications for you and your eyesight. It's something that's already on the radar at the Better Business Bureau, working to track these scams. The scams range from a, uh, different things such as your glasses, just knowing which glasses are safe. Here's Melanie Ducanel with the Better Business Bureau in southeastern Michigan. You can print anything on paper these days, yeah. so verifying how good these glasses are and who you're buying them from is really important. Already we've seen scammers selling items that are not approved to help you view the solar eclipse safely. Henry Ford Health ophthalmologist Dr. Kumar says he's very concerned about the products that are being sold right now that are not tested, that are not legit. Here's what you need to look for. You want it to have that ISO 12312-2. Um, that's been tested and that we know is safe. And don't think that your everyday sunglasses will work, that they're safe, that they'll give you the protection that you need. They won't. It's not going to cut it. It does not have the proper amount of protection to correctly and properly filter out the most harmful rays that come from direct observation of the sun. <coughs> All right, back out here live. So in the glasses themselves, that's where you see that important uh, key there, the ISO. But I will tell you, I'm just trying to my regular shades. I can see the light, I can see our photographer, but you put these babies on, it's a complete blackout. And yeah. I guess that's the point, right? Right, that's exactly right. These are not sunglasses. These are a complete blackout. These are essentially high-grade welder's glasses, but even the highest grade blocking all light out. So you can't wear these for anything other than looking at the sun, honestly. It's just pitch black when you look through them. Yeah, and unfortunately, the scammers, the products they're selling, obviously not to this quality. So that's why we want you to be safe and cautious. We're going to put all this information for you on our website. Click on Detroit.com so you can review it before the big eclipse. And do not take the risk. Get yeah. the glasses. Yeah. Absolutely. You Back to you guys. To. All right, fellas, thanks for the advice.